Hello everybody, it's your state senator Paul Ciccarella. Just taking the time to give you a quick recap of what's been going on throughout the course of the week and what I've been doing uh, to represent you and, and the constituents here in district. Over the last week, we've been taking a lot of time to review the bills so we can make sure we know them and understand them and we can speak to them on the floor if necessary prior to voting. Most of the time was spent here in district visiting local establishments and speaking with constituents. Um, while here in district today, I had lunch at J. Roos, which is a staple here in North Haven. Um, also a very generous business, always giving back to the community, sponsoring local teams. Um, so we had a great time uh, visiting there and having lunch. While there, uh, we noticed um, that they were participating in the North Haven Fork Project. Essentially what that is, um, it's, it's a project that was put together by the art teacher, Mrs. Schwartz, um, with a lot of help from uh, other teachers and uh, local establishments, um, and specifically the PE teacher, uh, Mr. Starin. Um, and uh, we also had the privilege of bumping into them while they were putting some of them up at other establishments we were visiting uh, today. Um, essentially what this the Fork Project is, uh, is a way to highlight local businesses and support local restaurants. So it is a um, idea that was put together that would allow the students to get a passport and visit all of the establishments that are participating. And they have these decorated large forks with all different kinds of uh, great art and different interesting names. And uh, at the end of this, whoever gets the passport filled out, it seems to be the consensus that they're going to maybe raffle off some of these or uh, enter in the name of, of the students and families that visit all of the establishments or the most establishments to win one of these great forks. And we'll, we'll put a picture below of me with a few of these um, great pieces of art. I hope I get an opportunity to, to bid on one and I could put it up in my, my office up at the Capitol if we get there. Uh, but it was a great uh, privilege to, to, to see such involvement here in the town to give back to the community with the teachers uh, of Green Acres. And I believe it was the fourth and fifth grade class um, that took the time to put this together and they thought that this would be a great idea to help the businesses. And, and you know, in this time we, we need as much help as we can get and we need to support each other in these times. Uh, so it was great to see that firsthand. Um, this week we did go up to the Capitol to caucus. That's a process where we come together as senators and, and talk about the pros and cons to the bills. We are hoping next week we'll be able to get into session and actually start uh, talking about some of these bills on the floor and voting on them. Uh, again, if you have any questions, concerns, reach out to me anytime. My information will be below. And please take that opportunity and reach out anytime. Thank you and stay safe.